the new newspaper agency system this project is basically to manage the newspaper circulation to that and distribution of the particular customer okay this uh, project is developed with visual basic 6.0 ms action crystal report to configure and run this application you need to have visual basic 6 ms access and crystal report in your system so you can use windows 7 10 or any system in the system okay so once you purchase this project you will get this uh, files this synopsis project report installation guide and source code okay now first we have to just show you what crystal we need to this crystal report you have to install in your system to see all the reports and everything okay this crystal report 8.5 8.5. First, I will start Visual Basic 6.0. So I will go Visual Basic 6.4 folder, Visual Studio. Then go Visual Basic 6. Right click over More, Run as Administrator. Yes. That's all. Now copy this part, source part. Copy it and open file. Open to it. Paste the folder. You need to run this with this project file. You need to open. Once you open, you will get all the forms here. So many forms you will see. Uh, I will show you that this is the main form where all the menu is there. Okay. Now first I will and this is the database folder. So I will go to the database. These are tables used for this project. Okay. So to log in, you need to have this uh, table. So I'll use the admin ID. If you want to change any text or anything, you can just go log in, and you can change that uh, this billing system. So you get all the code here. So if you want to change anything, you can change. I'll just run this project. So now we are doing admin. Password will be one two three. So now what is this project? This project basically I already told you. This is for newspaper circulation. Like whoever the agent agency is uh, supply the newspaper to door to door. We want to track which newspaper I have given to that particular customer and what will the billing. Because the newspaper rate is different for each day. Like Sunday, there more seven rupees, other days five rupees. Suppose any person can take a uh, multiple department. Like every day he give he take news Times of India. Like they on Sunday they give they take uh, Lokshat also. Like this way. So this is a customer. Okay, suppose I want to add a new customer. This is line. Line basically suppose one uh, agent is uh, supplying news for in Dadar East area. The other is a different chawl, a different area, different sector is there. So he manages this line. So once uh, every morning he will give some person to uh, give the newspaper for this uh, this route. So this is a line. So there is a line master also there. So this is a different different line. Okay. So I'll create one customer first. So I'll create a customer. Click on new. I'll put this uh, customer in the new. So, customer ID or two digit line ID. Which line it is? That is the one. Name of the customer. So I want to address the number. Delivery charge. Delivery charge is it will be treated much monthly. Second day is delivery charge. Close date no close date active. So, customer can I can select the date all date I will give that uh, particular uh, paper daily. Suppose customer is uh, going to holiday or anything, so I can close this particular day. So this particular day, customer will not uh, line will not generate for this paper for this ID, and I will not add the billing also for this. So once once the customer request that I will going to leave or something for this due date, so I will off the, from there. This is the update. Okay, so the new customer is added. 
this only part. So this two bit is not is not chargeable yet. Now once it is done, now I will go to product. So I I am setting this for two days. This is the product rate actually, like different different newspaper, if I select newspaper, like Times of India. Everything is 4.5. Sunday is the seven. So the the rate is increased. Sunday is ten rupees. So now one word, all the new transition will uh, charge ten rupees. So I can add product also. Like I want to add a new newspaper, new magazine. So everything we can from there we can add. Now transition. So every day or morning or evening, the car, the person will enter the what, how many pages, how many newspaper he want. So I want ten newspaper of. Economic Times. So this entry for Monday 20, like our Times 25. This a different option is there. Like I daily stock in order to read. The supplier I select for all for that will display. I already updated this too. I need to update. So all will be saved once. After that, customer requirement. Suppose I go to that line ID and product, so it will show what are the uh, means uh, paper, the Times of India paper, what is the number of Times of India is asking for customer. The so Monday to Tuesday everything it will show. So once it is done in customer requirement transaction. Now here it will what happen whatever the setting is there like that uh, customer wants this paper for 20 date so it will update our database based on if we mark on holiday or everything so billing will be generated based on this transaction okay so I'll just show so it will ask that I have not purchased that uh, product mint but I want to assign this product to this particular customer so it will ask for the Allocation. So I I can in what quantity I can in what time. Like telegraph also is required. So I am not actually order this paper, but customer is want. So I will do that. Now this uh, quantity is added. For this 20 April, these are the customer. These are the paper I I want to add the transaction. So I'll update it. So update is done. Now once it is done, so same way each and every day we have to just update that uh, transaction each evening. So once in the month end, I can generate that uh, billing directly. So the, it it is that. Customer requirement I have not completed. It is, it is for alert purposes here. Now I can generate the bill for this month. Yes, prepare full for all customer April from it prepare. Bill is generated. So if I want to show the bill, print bill, go print bill option, get bill. So this is the bill is there. Because I have only calculated only one day, okay. So that's why it is showing only five five rupees. So if I from one to twenty, if I continue do this activity, so it will show all the days bill to together summary. So if I want to generate the bill, so there is option print all or print selected. I want only selected items of so print selection. It will display in uh, that digital report. The two part, one is counter part, so each page only or one customer details, and then this fifteen rupees coming is that your delivery charge, or you can still print all, so all will come together. Now you can take a print on this print, prepared, reprinted stationery, and circulate to that 
custom one for collection. Now once the then you can receive the bill amount also like for this customer. You will create the amount need to receive twenty. Why twenty is coming because I have already added twenty rupees or fifteen rupees delivery charges. That's why it's showing more. Balance also we can calculate who is collected. Now there is a report, is a monthly sales report, so April month. I have received only 25 rupees, test is balance, is I pay not entered. So total amount, how much is total amount, line number, is summary. So I can daily received. line so this line there is no customer or is not receiver there really sales report display so it will show number of uh, different paper quantity stock and qu sell quantity what is with the cash and receipt means it will be that on counter sell return is zero total sell quantity rate no with the price so you can select and print the first. For so this particular line, whoever the customer will show, who is the paper quantity, everything will display. Now admin is that for if you want to add a new This is like if you want to change the part. So this is the this is the project. So from this project you can uh, use for any newspaper supplier in local area. It is very much helpful because mostly that uh, what happened they don't have the track like which paper is given. What is that charges everything? Mostly they are they are not follow up that payment. So it is used by so many vendor actually in Mumbai. So you can use this project as a college project, live project, whatever. You can modify it and you can give it to anybody. Okay. So once you partially get complete project with the report and everything ready, 